In this video, how to set up the Nighthawk Wi-Fi range extender as an access point. To avoid interference between your old system and the range extender, turn off the Wi-Fi on the old system. To do this, use a web browser and log in into your old device. Go to routerlogin.com and enter your login credentials. Then go to Advanced, and then Advanced Setup. Click on Wireless Settings, and uncheck the box that enables the router's radio. And apply. That is it. Now we are ready to place the extender in the network. Connect the range extender to the router or modem and power it up. Wait until the extender boots up completely you will know it is ready when the front indicator lights stop blinking simultaneously. Back on your router's interface, go to Administration, and then Attach Devices, and refresh the list. You should see the extender and its IP address. If you have more than one extender, you will see all their IP addresses here. Make note of the address in case you need it. Configure the Wi-Fi range extender as a Wi-Fi access point. Using a web browser, log in to the extender's interface by typing one of the addresses I am about to show you. In a new browser window, navigate to the URL that fits your equipment. Your computer will automatically go to the IP address of the extender and present the setup page. Complete the password recovery setup by filling in all the questions here. In case you lose your password, you'll be happy you did. Click Next. Then select Access Point. Now specify a name for your wireless network and a password. Note that all three of the radios will share the same SSID. Click Next. Set up a device to make sure that your settings work. Once you confirm that all is correct, check the box and click on Continue. That is it, you are done. For this and other topics, visit us at community.netgear.com.